Many people have asked me, how do you know what version of Kodi you're running, and how do you update to make sure it's the latest version? Today we're going to be looking at just that. Let's take a look. Okay guys, so before we get into updating Kodi, there's a few questions that we need to ask in regards to what kind of box you have. And the first one is the Android version that it's running. So what you want to do first is go into your settings. Every box should have a settings section. And here I open settings and I'm going to go to more settings. Next we're going to go to the bottom and to the right and it says about media center or media box. Yours might say something else but basically about device is what we're looking for. And here, as you can see, mine is running Android version 6.0.1. So the first question we have to ask is if it's an Android version of 5 or newer, then we're good. We can update to Kodi Krypton 17, which is the latest one. If it's 4.4 or earlier, then what you're going to have to do is uh, download a Kodi fork. So we're not going to get into that since all of the boxes that we have are 6.0 or newer. But if you want to update your old one, you can always bring it to us and we can do that for you. So the next thing we want to look at is taking a look and seeing which version of Kodi we are running currently. So I'm just going to back out to here. And this is still in the settings section and I'm going to open up apps. And in here is where we're going to find Kodi. So I'm just going to hover over Kodi, select it. And this is going to tell us which version we're running. So as you can see here, I'm running the latest one, which is Kodi 17.3, the latest official version, I should say. Now, if you're running 17.0 or later, so 17.1, 17.2, it's going to be a really easy update. So all you're going to have to do in that case is back out, open up the Google Play Store if you have your Google account connected. You're going to click on the search bar at the top, type in Kodi. Click enter, and here's Kodi right here. We're going to open that, and right where mine says open, yours should say update if you're running 17.0, 17.1, or 17.2. And once you hit update, it's going to ask you to install the latest version, and all of your add ons should migrate over to the latest version. You won't have an issue most of the time with losing any add ons. Now, if you're running a Kodi version of 16.1 or older, it's going to be a different scenario. So in that case, what I recommend is deleting the older version and doing what's known as a fresh install. So again, you would go into settings, apps, find your Kodi, and you would just uninstall and then go back into the Google Play Store and install the latest version. Now, just a warning, if you are doing that, you are going to lose all of your add-ons. When you install the latest version of Kodi, you're just going to have a clean Kodi with no add-ons on there. So you should know how to program them and if you don't you can always bring it to us and we can do that for you. Now the other option for those of you who don't have a Google account and can't get into the Play Store, you can still download it using your browser. So I'm just going to open the browser here and what we're going to do is just click on the bar on top and we're going to go to the Kodi official website. So what we're going to type in is Kodi.tv slash download and that's going to get bring us right to the download section of their web page now we're going to scroll down most of us will be doing this on an android box so what we're going to do is click android and the version that works for most boxes is going to be this arm 32 bit so once you click on that, it'll ask you to install it. You can go ahead and install, and that's going to give you the latest version right there. Now what we want to do is find the file that we just downloaded and open it up. So first we're going to go into the apps section. Yours might say all apps or something similar. And most boxes have this file browser. So I'm going to click on file browser, and it brings us to this menu. So if you don't see this local disk, option right here what you want to do is on the top left 
is this home button you can just click that and it'll bring you to this section and from here we're going to click on local disk and then down to download once you open this download folder you should see the file that you just downloaded right here I got mine off Google Play so it won't be on here but once you see yours you just click on that and it'll give you the options to install and then you should have it on your system so that's about it guys thanks for watching the video if you have any questions leave them in the comments section below this has been JT from Fort Mac TV boxes thanks again and we'll see you in the next one